So you, apparently, you have to close the game and reopen it to actually adjust the the in-game sensitivity, which is redonkulous. But there you go. Hmm. This is what I find kind of annoying with this game. Is that you might find places like this, right? Uh, oh, cool. An area where you can explore or something. And then you head in and it's all blocked off. And then in like, I don't know, a couple of quest lines later or something, this is going to be unblocked and I'm going to be able to go through there or through that door or this door is going to be open and I'm going to be able to go through there. And maybe those are going to be removed. So that, you know, I kind of appreciate that they managed to like reuse the same environments multiple times. But it's really annoying that you, I can't go exploring before it's ready, basically. Certainly need a repeat of what happened last time. Spectre is still sleeping. I actually want to try one of these runs with the um, <clears throat> Express fellow. Let's head over to his over here. Hello, Cavendish. Stanley! I've got more packages that need delivering. Start easy, yeah. Drive safely. I always do. I always drive safely. It's delivery time. Take the packages to the locations marked on your map and make all the deliveries on time or Stanley isn't paying. Easy enough. Wait, what? I'm not going to... Oh. I'm going to those, but I went to the wrong one first. Ow. Okay. And now we're going this way. I see. No. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Oh no, I went the wrong way. I went the wrong way. Crap roof. There we go. Nice. Let's do that again. I've got more packages that need to live. Good, good. We'll do it. Good luck. Remember, time is money. I mean, it looks like he has a monopoly, right? So, why does it have to be delivered this quickly, lore-wise? There we go. Delivered as promised. Hello, Stanley. I'll do the last one too, if you don't mind. Make some money. Yes. Drive safely. They always cut the sound a bit early. So for some of the sound bites, they cut the audio before they're done speaking. Feels a bit unpolished, to be honest. It's not the most pleasant of sounds, the sound, but uh, it wouldn't annoy me as much as, as it does if it wasn't for the fact that it doesn't always play. So it's supposed to make that sound every time you make a delivery, but sometimes eh, it just doesn't. And it's quite annoying. And it's one of those things that it's just the sounds in this game that are a bit bugged. And it's annoying. It's one of those tiny things that doesn't really affect the gameplay that much. Eh. It happens so often that it kind of does, but, you know, the game is still very much playable. It's just that it doesn't feel like it received the proper amount of love and care. 
That was annoying. It's like you're driving and all of a sudden the engine sound just disappears. Because the game just decided to, nah, we're not going to play the engine sounds at the moment. Yeah, we'll make it. By the skin of our teeth, but we made it. You need to be careful out there. You're spending lots of money on repairs. <laughs> well, you know. I like that they came upstairs, though. Yeah, oh, that's an explosion. Check out what's going on upstairs, and they came up with the elevator. That's a nice way to open this part of the level. I like that. It's a bit of a um, storytelling. Man, they can take so many hits. It's insane. We're this. Where are you? Hmm. Kicking our ass over here. Yeah, well, while well, you're hiding, I'm just gonna loot everything, okay? You just stay back there. I'll just have a quick look around and see if I find anything valuable. Ooh, there you go. I thought there would be like a button or something to push, get that elevator down, but I guess that's not where we're going yet. Back here? Where are you? There you are, I see ya. So this I'm actually kind of a fan of, right? Because we're walking through this area multiple times from multiple angles. This is where I came from the first time, then I went down through here and up through there. Now I'm moving my way back, so I'm using the cover from the, all, the completely the other side. It's all different, this has changed, and this opened up, so now this is like the new challenge going through here. They're re reusing a lot of environments really effectively. System. <laughs> Here, there's a lot of ammo and explosives. No reason why. <laughs> Let's bring out the uh, grenades just to make sure. Okay. That was a lot bigger than I thought it would be. Jesus, in the middle of the doorway, that's impressive. Ah! Jesus. Buckshot and fat boys. Pinkies. <laughs> I guess they're a word play on Twinkies, the uh, popular snack, and... The Pinky, which is a demon, an enemy from the Doom games. Any more? Yeah, there's one coming up over there. <laughs> Nothing can stand up to a good shotgun. That's <clears throat> that's something that the Doom games have taught us. 
I very much feel like we're closing in on the the huge one. Maybe the, we're going to save it later. That might be. Maybe it's just like a teaser for now. Well, I say that. I see uh, an open expanse. Yeah, okay. We're going to fight it now. <laughs> <clears throat> Let there be no mistake. And I'm guessing that this maybe is uh, like a launch. <laughs> this might produce more ammo for us over time. Yeah, it does. Okay, let's go for the tummy thing. Yeah, that was it. That's what I was supposed to do. Oh, holy crap. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do your thing. Come on. There we go. 